immersing ourselves in the vastness of the universe, we humans have always questioned the possibility of whether we really are the only species to have at a planet. Gazing at the stars, contemplating distant galaxies, and exploring the potential for life beyond our little blue planet, that potential has finally materialized. NASA's director has just announced that the James B. Space Telescope has captured something extraordinary at the edge of our cosmic neighborhood. The James Telescope has 10 Denton Proxima b, the closest potentially habitable exoplanet to Earth. We recalled that a possible city created by intelligent life had been detected, which to date we do not know. The recent James Webb discovery shows how the brightness of the artificial lights of the city of Proxima b has increased. In addition, the chemical composition of the atmosphere of this exoplanet has been discovered. So join us on this incredible journey to Proxima b to discover the details of this discovery. According to NASA's director, the JWST may have used all this technology effectively and has detected life on Proxima b, an exoplanet located just 4.2 for light years from our solar planet. Proxima b has become a phenomenon of fame due to its potential to be habitable. This exoplanet orbits its pairing star Proxima Centauri, a red dwarf that is much smaller and cooler than our Sun. Discovered in 2016, Proxima b lies in the star's habitable zone, also known as the Goldilocks zone, which is the region around the star where conditions could allow the presence of liquid water, a crucial ingredient for life as we know it. Proxima b's proximity to Earth and its location within the habitable zone have generated enormous interest and speculation about its ability to support life. However, it is important to keep in mind that the habitability of an exoplanet is a complex puzzle involving numerous factors. Proxima b is classified as an exoplanet with a mass approximately 1.3 times that of the Earth and has an orbital period of approximately 11.2 Earth days, meaning that it completes one orbit around Proxima Centauri in that time. However, things are not as simple as we may think. The fact that the planet is Earth-like in size and orbits a red dwarf does not guarantee that it is an exact replica of our world and that we can all move there. The habitability of Proxima b is determined by multiple factors, one of them is a planet's atmosphere, which acts as a protective shield and plays a crucial role in regulating temperature and life in general. However, the exact composition of Proxima b's atmosphere is still unknown, making it difficult to definitively determine its habitability. Scientists are working on methods to study the atmosphere of Proxima b, and a key tool in this process is the James Webb Space Telescope. This telescope will allow scientists to analyze the light that passes through the exoplanet's atmosphere during transits, which will give them information about spectral characteristics and help them search for possible biomarker molecules that could indicate the presence of life. Another important factor affecting habitability is the presence of water. Although Proxima b is within the habitable zone, it is crucial to determine whether it has a sufficient amount of water to be considered suitable for life. Water is a critical piece of the puzzle, and scientists are looking for signs of liquid water on the planet's surface, whether in the form of oceans, lakes, or rivers. These clues could be key to assessing the possibility of habitability on Proxima b. The presence of water in other states, such as ice or vapor, is also considered because water availability is essential to support biological processes and is considered a key indicator of habitability. The presence of Proxima b raises questions about its climate. Scientists must also investigate factors such as temperature, pressure, and geological activity on Proxima b to assess whether the planet is within a suitable range for life to thrive. Extreme conditions, such as scorching heat or extreme cold, can make survival difficult. Stability is also crucial, volcanic eruptions or seismic activity can disrupt habitability, but stability is a good sign. Proxima b is believed to be in a tidally locked state, meaning that one side of the planet remains permanently in darkness while the other side is permanently illuminated by the star. The stark contrast between the illuminated and dark sides could generate temperature variations and dynamics that could affect the planet's habitability. These are just some aspects that scientists are considering in the search for habitable planets. Scientists are investigating the chemical composition of Proxima b to analyze the presence of organic compounds such as amino acids and other molecules essential for life. They are also examining whether the planet receives enough energy from the star or other sources to fuel biological processes and allow organisms to grow, reproduce, and thrive. 
However, despite all these studies, the question arises as to whether Proxima b actually possesses all the necessary elements to be considered a habitable planet. Is there concrete evidence for this? Well, the discovery of Proxima b in 2016 was a remarkable achievement. Astronomers used the High Accuracy Radial Velocity Planet Searcher, HARPS, instrument to detect the subtle gravitational tug of an exoplanet around Proxima Centauri, our nearest neighboring star. This high-precision spectrograph is designed specifically to detect exoplanets and operates at the La Silla Observatory in Chile. It has been crucial in the discovery of numerous exoplanets, including Proxima b. The HARPS instrument operates using the radial velocity method, also known as the Doppler spectroscopic technique. Its function is to detect exoplanets by measuring the subtle shifts in the star's spectrum caused by the gravitational pull of an orbiting planet. These shifts, known as radial velocity or Doppler effect, occur due to the slight wobble of the star as it is dragged by the gravitational interaction with its companion planet. HARPS has an optical fiber that collects the light from the target star and directs it to the internal spectrograph. Inside the spectrograph, the light is dispersed into its different wavelengths, allowing astronomers to study the star's spectrum in detail. In this way, scientists can determine the star's radial velocity with exceptional accuracy. To achieve the high level of precision required for exoplanet detection, HARPS uses technologies and techniques that include a temperature-controlled environment. This allowed stabilizing the instrument and minimizing the effects of thermal variations that could interfere with accurate measurements. What do you think about Proxima b? Do you think it is habitable and that in the future we will be able to move to this amazing exoplanet? Let us know in the comments box. Thank you very much for watching the video. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.